Thanks a lot for coming along with Life with Bilsif. Let's see what's really going on. Oh, hey, how you doing? Welcome to Life with Bilsif. I'm your host, friggin' Bilsif. Today on the Bilsif Show, I'm just kind of cleaning up the old rallies here. I painted the other two black, as you know. I don't like them black either, so we're going to go back to silver on them. That's what I say. What do you say? Leave a comment down below and let me know. But I just wanted to clean these up a little bit. Because you get the black ones. Because I'm hoping to get this truck on the ground in the next couple days or so. So I can move it and buff the other side of the truck, if you know what I'm saying. How are you doing? <laughs> Easy on the sweater, Jeff. As you know, sometimes you gotta be careful when you're doing wire wheeling, eh? As you see there, things can happen pretty quick. The next thing you know, you can have a sweater or two stuck in her, Jeff. Very nice. <laughs> but this don't take long to do to clean up the rim. Paint. Now the inside doesn't matter as much as the outside because you're only going to make the inside look decent by giving a little squirt squirt. Right? Right. Holy. <coughs> Wild man with the thing that I am. Ooh, hey. This one here looks like a 10 inch rim, but the other ones I don't think are 10 inch rims. I think they must be an 8. These ones are definitely a little thicker than you are. If you ever clean these rims out, just get a pick tool and pick inside that groove and it gets out any rust shit stuck in there, you know what I mean? It works pretty good actually, it really does. Here we go. Now we need another tool. Come on, with a little bit of air we are. We gotta air this bad boy. Huh, I'll be dead. Let's face facts, the best way to do this is sandblasting, but hey, I don't have that option. I do, but I'm not going to use that option right now. So I just want to get them cleaned up, and a coat of paint on them, and it should last long enough for me to buy some rim. It should. Well, there we go. There's that one. Take this out of here, and we'll get one more out. Ah, yeah. Okay. Well, all that was done. Maybe the outside of this one. Super bad shape, just worse shape. You know what I'm saying? Tell you what, if you have yourself a good fucking. It works pretty good. It really does. Oh! Easy. Next! That's the most damage, is right where the beauty ring sits. She's frozen, Jim. Ooh, she sure is. Come on, baby. Nope, she's frozen, Captain. All right, doesn't look too bad there right now. Well, that's probably all we really need. Ow! Oh, wish I just had the money to buy rims right now and just get that a little bit. We gotta temporarily clean these up, we do. But if you're wondering, not too worried about the tires because they're dead, too. Snow, so there's all sorts of friggin' water and tires. Frig. Get in here, would you? It's too damn cold out there, Captain. Can't have you outside freezing, we can't. All oh, this fing cord is gonna dry me up. Can right it is. Oh god, I need a bigger garage. Wait a minute. No, I don't, because then I'll just collect the It would be nice to have a bigger garage to do this though. It is a little frustrating when you have a vehicle in a garage and it almost takes up the whole garage. And you're trying to work on it. It makes for a little bit of a difficult time. But hey, look at this. I know what you're gonna say. What the hell did you do that for? Well, just so you know, before I show you what I'm gonna show you, the box was only painted up the sides prepped properly. The bottom wasn't really prepped because I had a carpet in there. So all the paint was peeling up. I just took a wire orbital thing and I just sanded the whole damn floor of the bed. And I just trimmed clatter. I did, I know. But hey, it doesn't look bad. See, check it out. It looks all right, you know? It's a bit of a truck. I got a carpet liner for it. So it turned out pretty good, it did. You know, it's clean. That's what we want, we just want clean. It's not a show truck, 
we just want clean. But I get, like I said, I got a carpet that goes in here, so it'll be nice when it's done. A little black on the fenders because they're all scratched up. I just didn't want them to get rusty or anything like that. That's what we did. Should be getting the tailgate back soon. Not real soon, but soon. I painted the tailpipes black. Frig, everything's gonna be just mint. Have I done anything inside? No, nope, haven't done nothing inside yet. Still waiting for parts. Gotta get the rims painted and then I can get the tires back on, get this thing on the ground and get her out, turn around and then we can start buffing the other side. I buffed it all, but it's all dirty now. Again, no sense of getting carried away if you know what I mean. That's about what I'm doing right now. I'm just playing with some tires today. Gonna give them a quick paint job, pick up some gray paint, change them from black to gray. We're gonna go back to silver, I mean, sorry, on the rims. We'll get these two done and then we'll get them slapped on the truck, get it on the ground, get it out, get it spun around and get her back in. So if you wanna see that, stick around. I'm glad you're all here. Don't forget to subscribe, like, and hit the notification. This ain't much of a video today. I put the Christmas tree up today. It's snowing on the weekend. I did a bunch of family stuff, so there wasn't much content for you. Plus it's winter time and there's only so much you can do, if you know what I'm saying. You know what I'm saying? But love y'all, till next time. You know what to do for now.